Uh, hey guys, so today I'm just going to do a quick tutorial on um, how to make guns, like custom guns. So I'm going to, hold on, is this published? No, it's not published. It's a pop figure of me. Hold on. No. So it's a golden star off. Hold on. Start off shotgun. Oh dear. So if you're wondering how I made this, uh, hold on. I'm just gonna open the pallet, and I'll also show you guys how someone made this. We have a basic table. Hold on. Let's see. So I'll show you guys quickly how someone actually made this. So if you find one that's frozen, you can immediately pick it up like this. Then um yeah, you unfreeze this part, this part, and you'll see how they made it. So first, they designed the thing. Oh, gosh. Okay, that looks weird. Alright, so they first designed the thing, then they grab this, I forgot what it's called, and they clamp to the top the design and then the bottom parts like the thing to the gun and then oh jeez this body went to the freaking table right and then so then hold on Says it's grab okay, whatever. So they would. Oh gosh, no. So they would see where the gun is facing. They would place the gun inside. Go. They would. Grab the freeze and then freeze this object and then boom, you got one. You can shoot. And they did the exact same with this one. Well, I did. Alright, so they built, you build the thing. You build the outline of the gun. Then you grab like what the actual gun. You scale it down. You grab this part. And then... You attach like the other one. The shack! Yo! <clears throat> so that was my parents. I have to go in a few minutes. So you attach this part to the body of it, of that, and then you attach the body of the actual gun. Uh to the top of the clamp, and then as I said you just select it and then move it into the gun. And then again, freeze. You got a normal one. The normal pistol. And that is how you make guns. Yeah, you just. So as I said, you just, you make the thing, like the design, you get this clamp, you get the pistol or whatever type of weapon it is, and you attach the body of it, this clamp thing or whatever it is, uh, to the gun, then the very top, like this, 
yo, this rotator parts to the gun, or whatever it is, and then you bring this the design part into the gun so the gun won't be showing. And like, that's how. And then you freeze the design part so you don't grab it by accident, just pull it off. And then that's how you do it. Yeah. The same with basically any type of weapon. So, hope you enjoyed this. This is actually my first ever tutorial. Probably a bad tutorial, actually. I have to do a better one. Pop figures. I'll do a pop figure tutorial next, I think. Or, like, how to use something. Like, for example... Hold on, I gotta see. Like, for example, say... How to obtain skins. Like, how to obtain these. The ones you start off with, that probably everyone knows, the basketball blue skin, the basketball purple, you get the orange pistol. You don't get this, you only get this if you're on PS4 and you're, you have PS Plus. You get the orange paintball pistol, the the two basketballs. You get the purple paint pistol, the purple quest shield, and the yellow quest shield, and the paintball shield, the purple paintball shield. And yeah, or I can just do that right now. Two tutorials in one. It's probably very easy. Most people know it. Weeklies. Weeklies are usually where skins are. This week's skin uh, is "Be Still My Heart." It's um, I have it. If you, if you guys, you know, you can see on the thing, you can see like what it is. It's just like a Valentine's Day thing. You do. Yeah, you do challenges, basically. You have to complete any three. And you never know. It could be skins. It could be items. It could be, like, outfits, hair, hats and stuff. And, uh, yeah, actually, three tutorials in one. Best way, uh, if you started the game, a best way to earn tokens, uh, play, like, a quest or something, and if you die, at the end, you get this, um, first activity of the day thing and like uh what do you call it you that gives you like from 10 to 50 tokens i think and if you play like activities and like dodgeball or 3d charades or something like that you could give token boxes from 10 to 500 and also orientation challenges like when you first start off you got those challenges and uh, you can start you can start doing those. Those will earn you a lot of tokens. I've already have them done, so because it doesn't show the tabs. Also, daily challenges. So, like for example, this this days is play the Rise of Jumbotron. What does that say? Hold on. A daily challenge. Yeah, complete daily challenges to earn tokens and uh, to cheer someone. Mostly it's like games, like playing one game in like dodgeball, two games in dodgeball, jumbotron, something like that. And like kill an enemy in it. Like for example, cause a killing, okay. And if you guys want to know how to cheer someone, you, uh, hold on. Okay. Minion. So, for example, I'll show you how to cheer a room. First. Say, um, Abyssal Frost. You click the little eye icon. The eye icon there. You click on that. Uh, you have the owner. You can cheer the owner too right here. Cheer. But first we're going to do these. So you can cheer it right here. I don't know for some reason I can't cheer it right now. You can cheer here. It has This room has 1,035 cheers. You can also favorite it. You can... Basically you can see the name and stuff. And how to cheer a person. So I'll go cheer one of my friends. Odd memes. So you you can also gift them, favorite them and stuff, but that's all different. You can cheer. You click cheer. It'll show you how much cheers you have. 
anonymous is like if it shows your name. So I say you don't want it to show your name. Click anonymous and send. So like I'll send it to him. I'll say anonymous. When I send it to him, if I would send it to him, it would say anonymous. So it wouldn't show who sent it to him. But like say I select one without anonymous, it'll show who sent it. So like for example, I sent it, I'll show my name. I'll just give him a normal cheer. And if I can't show you what happens if you get cheered, but I'll tell you what happens. So when you get like a notification, it's, it's Josh McChamp. Okay, after I show you this, I have to go. Okay. Me dad. You can go into notification. And you would get a notification. That's what you, you can press OK, which wouldn't do anything. And you'll press yay. Uh, you can get like a giant green particle around you. And if you get like a max amount, like if you get like a specific amount of cheers, I think. Or if someone cheers you like an amount. I think, yeah, you unlock these and it will go beside your name. So I have the like one. It goes beside my name wherever someone sees it. And yeah, so I have to go now. Bye.